Hey, Dustin here from Happy Pal Outdoors, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Walker's Razor Slim Electric Muffs, uh, the Patriot Series. So we'll dive right into it. So I always like to start off with uh, an unboxing. So this is how uh, the muffs are presented when they're in packaging. Um, and these are supposed to be the features on the back. Uh, so we'll go ahead and box it. These have been open prior, so for your copy, there will be, there'll be more loose items in here. Okay, so it looks like we've got a plastic tray here. Um, and instructions of the uh, the muffs, okay. And then uh, the muffs themselves. Uh, I do believe when I open these, these were not on. These are Velcro, so these can come off. Now I think this is exclusive to the Patriot series. Uh, so for all your standard ones that won't have them. And then walkers across the top. Default out. This is your uh, volume knob. This is going to uh, basically these headphones have a microphone in them and they let you hear, they kind of amplify the sound uh, outside, but then whenever you're shooting, it'll dampen that sound immediately at uh, 0.02 seconds uh, reaction time. So this right here, the microphone brings in the audio and you can, you can basically adjust the gain of how much you're hearing uh, outside. Um, and I believe this is one of the microphone areas on either side. Okay, that will push up. Now this right here is, this is the plate where you'll insert your AAA batteries. It takes two AAA batteries, which do come with the, the earmuffs. They were packaged uh, separately. Let's go in there. Okay. So uh, that is what you get in the box. Now I'll take you back up top for uh, further review. Do need to mention that these also have uh, standard audio input jack right here so that you can listen to music. Okay, so I'm gonna state again that these are the Patriot series um, with the flag Velcro patches um, and they are made of a composite material that's supposed to help with sound dampening. Uh, we did, I did use these out in the field whenever we're, I was filming a uh, long range shooting competition, and, uh, which I'll get into in a minute. So uh, as far as the fit goes, they're, they fit my head. I got a pretty big head, and, uh, but they fit pretty comfortably. You know, took them out to that uh, long range shoot and I didn't really have any issues as far as being uncomfortable with with the headphones on so um comfortability wise they're they're pretty good they're, they're not they don't get too too much in the way and also uh, let me talk about the the dynamic range gain on here uh, so you can you can amplify it by turning up this up but makes it to where you'd be like hearing naturally without the earmuffs um, of course it's supposed to keep out uh, it's supposed to be low noise and low frequency now, I will say when I was out on the range uh, using these, I did get some, fr uh, some interference from, I don't know if it was from a cell phone or camera or uh, whatever else, but there was a, a buzzing sound um, from time to time or, or a little bit of a um, ringing noise almost. So it uh, wasn't 100% noise canceling or, or frequency reducing what was that. Now, as far as like the compression, sound activated compression, uh, that was pretty spot on. So anytime 
I, I never had an issue with uh, gun firing and, and the sound not being compressed or dampened uh, in any way. So um, the, for that, it definitely does its job very well. I will say full disclosure, I didn't use the audio input jack here to play music or anything through. I'm assuming it works just fine like a natural, like a regular set of headphones, but um, I will clarify that I have not used that portion. So I can't say for sure whether that's, whether it works well or not on the uh, on that part. Of course, as I, as I showed in the unboxing, it does take two AAA batteries, which do come with the, uh, the headphones. So I thought that was pretty good. These are pretty compact. They can pop out, pop in pretty easily. And, uh, they don't take up a lot of space at all. You put this in your in your pack or gear or anything else and and not have to worry about space really. As far as the material goes, um, it's, it's what it's made out of. Um, it's, it's like a, it's a composite material. And then I don't think this is authentic rubber. I think this is like a kind of like a, a faux rubber. And then it's got some padding on the inside, uh, I guess, to help dampen, dampen noise. Um, so overall, the, the, the material it's made out of is pretty good. Yeah, these are manufactured, uh, I believe, in Grand Prairie, Texas. So these are American made. Overall, uh, as far as the aesthetics, you know, I'd give it a, a plus on that. I mean, they, they're aesthetically pleasing. And the component material uh, is really good. The, the materials it's ma manufactured from are, are high-end quality materials uh, for sure. And then as far as noise reduction, uh, I would definitely give that a plus too. It's, it's, it's really good at reducing noise, um, especially during those high decibel uh, moments whenever a uh, gun's firing. Now, as far as, uh, as far as like keeping out frequencies and stuff, I'd have to give it a hit on it because I did have that issue with the frequency coming through. Um, I don't, I, I believe it's from my cell phone. I don't think it's from the camera. Uh, so I feel like most people, uh, would practice, would have this similar issue. Uh, so I will have to dock it a little bit on that. It didn't block out all frequencies. It's definitely prone to, uh, having some kind of interference from electric devices. So just, you know, take that in, into account. Overall, I would give these, I'd give these a 7.5 out of 10. Um, I think these are I think these are really good quality, you know, for the price for the price point. And uh, you can find them at Happy Hollow. Um, there should be a link in the description below. Uh, you can go to their website and order them there. I think they say retail at retail around fifty three dollars uh, for this set. So I think that's a pretty good price point. And uh, anyway, thanks for uh, tuning in for review, and see you on the next one. This review has been brought to you by Happy Hollow Outdoors. Shop online at happyhollowoutdoors.com or find us in store at 985 9th Street West in Red Bay, Alabama. Find your happy place.